one of the very frequent questions which the mothers they ask me is that how many hours in a day the child should see television or the older children they should spend time on screen maybe television maybe computer maybe video games and these things it's a very pertinent question and very valid question in the modern times now i will like to tell you that according to an american study the children who are less than 3 years almost 66% of them that is 2/3 of them they watch television more than 2 hours in a day and the children who are less than 6 years almost 100% of them they watch almost 2 hours a day and the children who are in their teens that is between 8 to 18 years they watch television on an average of maybe television computer and the screen watching is about 4 hours a day which is much more than recommended according to the american academy of pediatrics <clears throat> i will like to again tell you according to the american academy of pediatrics the children who are less than 2 years should not watch any tv the child is not allowed to watch any tv because it can have detrimental effects on the eyes and on the psychology of the child now a child who is more than 2 years can see tv 1 hour a day or at the most 2 hours a day never more than that and this tv viewing should all always be supervised by the adults the child should not go and see the uh, television on his own he has to be accompanied by an adult who understands the programs and is communicating to the child that what is fantasy what is reality what is wrong in this program what is right in this program and in what way uh, we can utilize these programs for the education of the child and there are certain channels there are certain programs which are absolutely prohibited for the viewing of the children and the adult should always accompany a child to see that they are not viewing the programs or the channels which are not desirable for the for those children of that age now what are the side effects if a child watches tv more than the recommended number of hours i will like to tell you it is it is seen that the children who see more than 2 hours in a day television they are likely to be more overweight why because while watching television they eat junk food they eat food so they are likely to eat more their activity is decreased they don't go to the parks they don't have time to play because they are always busy in watching so ultimately the result comes that these children are overweight secondly these children are likely to be violent they are likely to be more on the psychopathic side because they see fun in violence so they lose that human sensitivity of violence if they are seeing violent programs all the time all the time all the way then probably they are likely to become more violent adults they are likely to become more psychopaths than the normal children the substance abuse is more common in children who watch television all the time substance abuse in the form of cigarette smoking drugs alcoholism it has been seen that even children who watch television more frequently they are also likely to get involved into sexual acts early in the teens or late in the teens they are more likely to get affected by that television so television has got lot many of side effects and we should be very clear that in no way the children should watch more than 1 hour in a day and that too under supervision of the parents or supervision of an adult tv viewing is also associated with accidents we have seen where a he man show or a spider man show I have seen the children jumping off the cliff or off the windows thinking themselves as spider man and finally hurting themselves having fractures and other things so even they are prone for more accidents so these are the side effects of excessive tv viewing they can have an impact on the physical injuries these children are likely to be overweight these children are likely to have uh, impaired psychology they are likely to be more aggressive as adults they are likely to be uh, psychopaths and moreover they are always confused what is fantasy and what is reality and the way the they glamorize the substance abuse that a macho man is uh, uh, having a cigarette smoke and puffs so they also go towards the substance abuse now how to limit the tv viewing in the children number first thing is that the parents and adults should Uh, restrict their number of hours if they want to preach the children so this is very important that adult viewing of the tv should be decreased otherwise the children are not going to have a decreased time on the tv secondly 
TV should not be there in the bedrooms, TV should not be there in the dining room. While feeding or while taking meals, the child should not watch TV because it can be, it can have a detrimental effect on the child. Weekend band should be there in every house. Generally, it is seen that TV is more abused during the weekends when the child is free from morning till evening. So, weekend band should be there. There should be more activity. Parents should take them out. They should take them to the museums. They can uh, take them to the science museums or to the parks or to the gym centers or to the swimming pools. Outdoor activity should be encouraged because after all the time is same. So the children have to spend productive time. So they should go out and spend more time so that little time is left for the television. And the parents should encourage that in children room there should be no TV and rather there should be a lot of games. There should be a lot of fun games, lot of other games so that the children are always engrossed in these activities. <sighs> Above all, I must tell you that even if we have to, the child is viewing television for one or two hours, it should be under the supervision of a parent. And here the parent, pediatrician, doctor, teacher, they should all club together and educate the child. There is a big role of health education. The child should be educated. What are the side effects of the television? If they watch television, then their academic performance is likely to be low. They are likely to be more obese. If all these things are educated, the children are educated nicely, then probably this problem will come to the minimum.